So I wanted to do a quick video on this OneDrive um, problem that I've been having. You can see OneDrive, it, it, it wasn't showing at all in the notification tray and it still isn't, or right now it isn't. And um, if you went to the file browser, there's no OneDrive folder that syncs up or anything like that. And um, right now I have it uninstalled, but when it was installed, it still was having that problem. And so most people were saying, like to uninstall it and then uh, reinstall it and that wasn't working for me and um, I'll leave like these these uh, people's solutions in the in, in a link as well just in case you want to try it if mine doesn't work or something uh, but here like I can install it and um, I'm going to the command prompt and uh, do run at, as administrator And uh, I need to actually get this installed, so running the OneDrive setup. And uh, I've also I also was trying like the OneDrive setup that you can download from Microsoft themselves, um, which there's a download link right down here, um, and it does the same thing. It has the same problem. So while this is installing, I want to show you the solution that I found. Um, so if you go into regedit, so you can do Windows R and run regedit. And then inside of regedit is where you'll find the solution. At least I did. So inside of HKey local machine go into software and then down into policies and then Microsoft and then Windows and then go down to OneDrive. Now what you'll see here is if you have the same problem as I did somehow this got set to one disable file sync and GSC. Um, so this needs to actually be set to zero to not disable the file sync so just double click on that and set it to zero and after I did that and I got it installed and everything then it just started working um, one thing after I got it installed I actually did uh, reinstall it and you can also try just running this reset command uh, I'm not going to run it now because it's not installed yet uh, but it doesn't take any time at all. Local app data, Microsoft OneDrive, OneDrive.exe slash reset. And uh, I'll leave all these commands in the description if you want to check it out. Um, and when I was talking about uninstalling and reinstalling it, uh, you can also just uninstall from add or remove programs. So if you go into here, you could uninstall OneDrive and then you could download the OneDrive from Windows and reinstall it but like I said that wasn't working for me so I needed to go into the registry and set this tag to zero and it looks like OneDrive finished so OneDrive finished installing and you can see that there's a OneDrive uh, notification tray icon down here uh, which was not there before and if I go into the file browser you'll see that my OneDrive folder is here and it is currently syncing and now you can see I just got this setup OneDrive um, pop up here so I guess it's not syncing yet this was old files but as you can see everything is working now so I hope this helps thank you all for watching have a great day